Okay guys, so we're back at the 323 today. Thought we may be gonna get this done today. It's gonna torque down the head bolts, got the head back on. Everything was going great, except all the head bolts tightened down good. I pre-checked them before I put the head on. Everything torqued down fine. Uh, I was doing the very last bolt, only on the second torque spec, not the final. Felt a little bit squishy, not bad. I thought, well, I'll go ahead and pull it out and check it, just in case there's a little bit of oil left in it. Even though I cleaned the holes out, I slid the bolt back out. This is what's on the end of the bolt. That, my friends, is the threads from the inside of the block. It's the aluminum threads. Pulled it out, totally stripped it. These motors, if there's any question about it at all, I put new time certs in all of them. You cannot go to O'Reilly's or AutoZone and buy these time certs. They're too short. You have to get the 24 millimeters ones from eBay or Amazon that are steel. It's the only ones that will work and will not pull out down the road when you're driving the car. So, of course, I didn't have any here. They're about $27 for the whole set. It's not that bad to put them in. It's actually pretty easy. The only thing that sucks about this car on these three series, I did not take off the exhaust of the collector. I took off the manifolds, as you can see right here. I just have two nuts finger tied on each one so they don't fall off. So you can see on these three series cars on the E46s, how tight that back manifold is against the strut tower or frame rail, you might say. Um, that makes these a real pain in the ass to put back on and make sure your gasket's right. You have to hook the studs, the exhaust studs, down in there. So, pretty much order some off eBay. They should be here, I don't know, three or four days if the post office decides to send them through right. But the post office, it could be two days, it could be three weeks. You just don't know. Uh, so that's what the story is, the 323 build. As of right now, it's at a standstill. I think we'll just go back to working on other stuff until these parts come in. That's all for today's video. I think uh, tomorrow we're going to work on the 528 and try to get that thing finished up. It still needs window regulators and some other odds and ends. Uh, so that's all for today. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Like me on Facebook, Instagram, Nathan's DIY Garage. Thank you very much.